Greetings, citizens of Nindy Nation, and thanks for tuning in to another episode of Let's Play Nindies, brought to you by the Nindy Nation podcast. I'm Jeff, and today we're going to take a look at Ape Out, developed by Gabe Cazillo and published by Devolver Digital. So if you're not familiar, Ape Out is known for its soundtrack, and as such, the game is laid out as albums or vinyls. We're going to go ahead and start from right at the beginning and run through a few different levels so you can get an idea of what Ape Out is all about. Picking up our drumsticks. Oh, that's cool. Whoa. What are we doing here? Left stick, right trigger. <laughs> Come here. Ooh. Excuse me. You. Excuse me. Wow. Disc one, subject four. Let's do this. And so the levels themselves have static beginnings and endings from what I understand, but that the middle of the level itself is procedurally generated. So if there's any specific themes that they need to hit in a level, oh look at that, I can pick up an arm. <laughs> What's that? Uh oh. Ooh! I don't know how many hits I can take until I'm toast. He opened the door at the wrong time. Oh no, oh no, run away. Ooh, we're heating up. Sorry about that. Ugh, excuse me. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, so note to self, I shouldn't run away. Oh, is that my blood? Whoa! So there's what the level looks like. Okay, so we've got a smaller pattern at the beginning. That's probably the tutorial part. Oh no. <laughs> Is that ever gonna get old? Go! <laughs> oh, explosion! Okay, so we gotta watch out for the explosive guys. All right, let's do this again. So if you haven't noticed, I'm playing the game on PC. I apologize to my Nindy Nation purists if there is such a thing. We don't need console wars, people. Um, but uh, games get expensive to be purchasing every week for the podcast. If you're not aware, I have no sponsorships or <laughs> anything like that. So, uh, and, and I have no Patreon or no monetization. So I'm just buying games and trying to find time to talk to you guys about them. Uh, so... Uh, Ape Out is actually on the Xbox Game Pass right now, and so I'm playing the game on PC. Ooh, so that guy blows up. Oh no, get away! Okay, that was level two. Level three, knock knock. Let's check this out. Boom! <laughs> I love how there seems to always be a guy right there at the door. Oh, that was bad. Grab the left trigger, got it, and pull! Oh, I didn't. Stop it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, run monkey! Run monkey! Oh, this is not gonna end well. Oh, did they blow themselves up? Way to go. Yikes, look at that hallway. Can we appreciate how awesome the soundtrack is for a minute. Just listen to it when I run into dudes. I don't know if that was a false alarm. Yikes. All right, let's set off the alarm. Oh no, I'm bleeding. Go, monkey, run! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! 
No! Did I make it? Monkey is free! Oh, did we beat that first part? Cool, end of side A. All right, let's check something else out in the game. So the second half of chapter two, or I guess most of chapter two, is much more complicated. You are just working your way down a uh, skyscraper. And there's all these snipers everywhere, and you can throw enemies out the window. I'll show you in a second, as soon as I can find one. So we see we look for these floors. I think there's four floors per level. Many, many more enemies. Ooh. Oh no! Whoa! Monkey ran out the window! Ooh, did you hear that guy dong <laughs> into that pipe? There's these little guys in each level and they run from you. And if you chase them, a lot of times you end up getting screwed. See those guys, those little guys? It's kind of, I think it's kind of like a trick. Ooh, get away! All right, we can beat the level. We get past this room. Oh, dead end. Dead end, dead monkey. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out of here. All right, made it out of that chapter. Circle back. <laughs> That's one way to start the level. That's nice that the camera pans over so that I can see my destruction. Uh-oh, I didn't push him away. Now he's mad. Oh no, dead end, dead end, dead monkey. What happens when we're at the bottom of the building? Do we start running around the streets? Ooh! Oh no! No, wrong way! Dead end. Dead monkey! Oh no, dead end, dead monkey! Get out of here! You go out the window. <gasps> Did I make it? Down and out. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, we made it. We made it. We made it. Oh no, we're in like the cafeteria, <laughs> the lobby. I'm not gonna be able to run straight through this. I'm crazy. Is that an innocent bystander? Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh! This is gonna be hard. Oh! No! Oh! Yeah! Made it! The ape is out! Phew! So that's like the end of the second disc, as you just saw. That is a great place to stop. Thanks for joining me today. Again, I am Jeff. This has been Let's Play Nindies for Ape Out, developed by Gabe Cazillo and published by Devolver Digital. If you like what you saw here, know that we're brought to you by the Nindy Nation podcast, a weekly show dedicated to all things independently developed for the Switch. Everything Nindy Nation is brought to you by the Nintendo Village. Check out all of their shows, feature articles, reviews, and all that good stuff by a bunch of folks who love Nintendo over at the NintendoVillage.com. And if you want to chat about things or yell at me for not playing this on the Switch or whatever the case may be, feel free to do so on Twitter at Nindy Nation. As always, thanks for joining. My name is Jeff. This has been Let's Play Nindies, and I hope to catch you on another episode or on the weekly Nindy Nation podcast. And if you're looking for something to keep your Joy-Con synced, I can tell you one thing, Ape Out will do just that.